course, it's been a tough year, so we hope that mom is close in some way, somehow today. Very happy Mother's Day to my mom and, of course, my wife as well. I'd like to say the same thing. All of our moms in our lives, my wife Marcy and uh, <laughs> our four kids, I, I know it's a big day at our house. We love mom and we love all of you, Marlins moms, as well. Sandy was making his eighth start this year. That surpasses his total from the shortened 2020 season. But a 295 ERA this year, 298 over his last 14. Quickly 0 and 2 to Tyrone Taylor. Wow, what a pitch from Sandy. Gets a strikeout and works a 1 2 3 first. Brett Anderson ready to go. He likes to work fast and he is anxious to get this start started tonight. And there's a strikeout to start it for Brett Anderson. And fourth consecutive strikeout for Rojas. The home run in the first, then three strikeouts last night. When Corbin Burns returns, and he is expected to come back on the next homestand. And that's an out at first. Vogelback makes a diving play. Dickerson had nowhere to go. He's standing at the bag. He thinks he was safe. And a pretty good move. He was taken off. Pretty close. He was stealing a base. He got picked off. Good throw. Let's see. Did they get him? Yeah, I think he's out. I don't think there's enough yeah. to overturn that. Yeah, they won't challenge. Too risky for Don Mattingly this early. So Anderson wipes out the base runner, faces three batters in the first. Two and two on the way. Is hit in the air out toward left field. Back goes Dickerson in front of the track, makes the catch. Sandy gets through the second. Scoreless. They've had great success away from American Family Field. Yeah, it'd be nice to return to the favor to the Marlins, who won a series in Milwaukee as Anderson strikes out Anderson, and Anderson called it that way. <laughs> and they don't even have their quote unquote best. Catcher Omar Narvaez, their offensive threat on the IL. That's a dribbler, left side of the infield. Brinson's going to beat it out. An infield single. With two strikes, just put the ball in play. You're hoping for Sweet Lou. We talked about missing a couple of ball games, but we're starting to really swing the bat better. Oh, and to the count on Leon. On the ground, routine for Wong. So Anderson works around an infield hit and a hit batter. Marlon Strand, two. Play, so very thoughtful gesture from the Marlins. Oh, there's no question about it. This one grounded to the right side. Diaz spins. They get one and they get two. The pitcher Brett Anderson running may have given Miggy just enough time to flip that double play. Well, nicely done by Sandy. It was a good pitch to Anderson. He went, he was way out in front of it. Boxberger still warming with purpose in the bullpen. Could be Anderson's last hitter. We'll see. 3 2 pitch and he got him. He fires the bat. Fooled badly. And Brett Anderson with a strikeout to end the inning. Daniel Vogelback leads off. Vogelback bounced out his first time up. Hits a rocket down the right field line. It is gone. Daniel Vogelback, a frozen rope out of here. His third home run. And the Brewers have a one to nothing lead on a rocket to right. Boy, that had some hit speed on it. How about that? A 97 mile an hour fastball in on his hands, and he's able to turn it around. Not just that, but keep it fair. Out to center field. Brinson in his tracks. Sandy needs to make the pitch and does. Leaves him loaded, but the Vogelback homer gives the Brewers a 1 0 lead. Boxberger having a hard time putting Leon away. Another 3 2 and a swing and a miss. Got him with a changeup. Nasty change. Boxberger leaves two. Brewers lead 1 0. Mentioning Cabrera on Friday past Babe Ruth mm. on the hits list. Of course, Marlins fans recall his first hit. That's knocked down by Wong, and Rojas is aboard. Now first hit of the ball game for Rojas. Second quality at bat. One ball, one strike. And a pick at first. Out at first. That's what he's got. You could tell. I don't know if he was itching to run or something. An indication to the dugout and a little over anxious. And for the second time today, 
A Brewer pitcher picks off a runner at first base. Yeah, Brent Anderson picked off Dickerson. That's a good move by Lauer to erase the base runner. Two outs, nobody on. Three defenders right side. Outfield not too deep. The pitch swung on and missed. Sandy with a strikeout and back to back one two three innings. That brings up Brian Anderson. Jammed him. That was a cutter. And Arias makes a play How about that. Eric Lauer putting the Marlins middle of the order down in order with a strikeout. Two scoreless for Lauer. One nothing. Brewer still lead. Sandy Alcantara is out there to face the Brewers here in the seventh. Pitch is swung on and missed. And that's it for Urias. A strikeout for Sandy. One to nothing. Brewers here. Teams even in hits, five aside. Here's the one and two, and that's over. Strike three called, and Kane doesn't like the call, but the inning is over for the Brewers, and Maley is left at second base. Princeton's looking for his third hit. Had an infield hit in the second, singled out into left in the fourth inning. Brinson, left center field, puts a charge in to it. Oh, it's off the top of the wall. That's a home run for Lewis Brinson, and this game is tied. Have yourself a day, sweet Lou. Welcome back to the lineup. My goodness. Now we have continued to talk throughout the homestand. You know, some directional hitting with Sweet Lou. Pointing up to the Sweets. Mom is here. That is awesome. This turns into a big at bat with runners on the corners. In the air, left field, long run over for Dickerson. Ranging makes the play, and Floro works out of the jam. We'll head to the bottom of the eighth. Tied at one. Marlins and Brewers. Hooked up in a dandy 1 1 game. And the Brewers have their closer on the mound, Josh Hader. 1 2 pitch. Got him. A sweeper, a breaking ball. Anderson strikes out. Hader with his first K. 1 and 2 the count. Ninth inning. And he got him. Chased a breaking ball. Maley blocks it well, puts the tag on him to secure it. Hader with a couple of Ks. We go to extra innings, put a man on second. Vogelback will be sent to first base. You're going to be careful with Vogel back and leave it up to Tyrone Taylor, the right handed batter. Anything hits the outfield grass, he'll score. That ball's in the air, left field down into the gap. Reyes on his way around, he will score. Tyrone Taylor delivers in the clutch. Yeah, there you go. Yeah, you walk a guy in front of you. Two to one Brewers as Taylor comes through. Rasmussen, a save opportunity for the first time in the big leagues, a 25 year old. And it's a first pitch slider right off the end of the bat. Wong is there. Throw to first. Ball game. Drew Rasmussen with his first career professional save. And the Brewers win on Mother's Day.